this video, I will show you a brand new AI video generator tool called LTX Studio. Now, LTX Studio is completely free tool to use and I will leave a link for it in the video description below and I will show you all the features it has to offer. For the reference images, I will use Leonardo.ai to generate them. Now, if you like this kind of content, then make sure that you smash up the subscribe button and you can also like this video and make sure that you also turn on notification bell so you will get notified whenever I upload a brand new video. So with that out of the way, let's go straight to the LTX studio. Here you guys will see these three options. First one is create a story. Then the second one is visualize your concept. And here at the bottom, you will find start from scratch, which I will do right now. Here, I'll just click on new blank project. I will call this project project number one. Here, you also have three options for the aspect ratio, 16 by nine, one by one, and nine by 16. I will just go by the standard 16 by nine. And for the video style, you can also pick here from plethora of presets. Here I will go, for example, with the cinematic one. Now for the style reference, I will go here to leonardo.ai and I will try to generate or just get one of the images from this first page of leonardo.ai. Now keep in mind that leonardo.ai is also a free AI tool. However, with a free account, you only get around 150 free tokens. So if you guys use the link in the video description below, you guys can upgrade to one of more premium versions of leonardo.ai and it actually doesn't cost you anything more by using the link and you get also get to support this channel. For example, if you upgrade to this model, you will get around 60,000 fast tokens and it will also reset monthly. With a free account, you only get around 150, which I think will expire quite quickly. So if you guys are using this tool quite much, I think it's right thing to do that you use the link in the video description down below, sign up for leonardo.ai and upgrade to one of more premium versions of leonardo.ai because you will get a ton of benefits as I mentioned before. Now on the first page I will just pick one of the images for the reference, this one right here. I think this is a really nice vibrant image generated by leonardo.ai. Now here I will just click on this download arrow to get this image and now I'll go back to the LTX studio. Now here I will click on drag image here and I will just click on the the image which I got from leonardo.ai. Here I'll click on open and right now you can see that it is uploading. Now here you can also see style reference intensity which is almost to the max. I will leave it here as it is. Now here we can also see cinematic inspira inspiration which you can also put in. I will type in vibrant jungle. Okay and we can also add a character to that. So here if I click on add a character we can call this character let's say parrot bob the age of the parrot i think it would be let's say seven years and then for the appearance we have here let's say a vibrant feather and for the clothing i'll just put this inside here and for the voice i will find something really really cool let's say this one right here and i'll change the age just to 27 and here we have the voice here uh, let's say i will go with the dave conversational sound okay but here we can see that it is a woman so we currently have this parrot bob now fortunately it isn't doing anything right here so i'll just change the name to let's say parrot and and that's pretty much it i'll click on apply here and i'll click on start so here we have a few of the other options here as well just like the project settings for example you have project name video style and here we have the cast we currently have only one character inside here then we have the soundtrack which you can also upload by the way and here you can just go here to the sounds and add some keywords to that as well and here we have the voiceover so here what i'll do i'll click on a scene setting one basically for the scene one here i will call it let's say vibrant jungle and for the lighting i will go with the sunlight for weather i wish i will go with clear skies for the sound i will leave it as the voiceover and here i will go with the scene sound i'll add that and i will go with peaceful jungle i'll go with this one right here which 
which LTX Studio actually recommended me. And here we have basically the voiceover. And uh, if you go here to the voiceover, you can see here the narration, which is currently empty. So to generate this voiceover, I'll use Copilot from Microsoft. Now here I will just go here and uh, add a prompt for the narration. So for example, I will call it write me a script for a story in vibrant jungle and let's see what will copilot from microsoft come up with and here we have this for example script we have here the scene one scene two scene three here i'll go with this script right here and i will go to here go to the voiceover and i will paste this script here so you can see that it's currently a bit too long say so here i will go and delete that much you can also see that it's also a bit long once again so here i will have to actually go here to the 30 signs and here i will leave it as it is click apply and now we have here the prompt and here i will go with a vibrant jungle then for the shot type, I will go with the very wide shot, wide shot. For the sound effects, I will click here, peaceful jungle. Or we can just go here and instead of peaceful jung jungle, insert here birds. And we have here birds chirping in park. I'll go with this one with the ambience. So this one right here. And here well, I'll click on generate video. Now you can see that it's currently generating and hopefully it will take into the account all these options we put inside the LTX Studio. Here we can see that the generations are quite fast. So let's just wait for it and let's see the actual end result. So here we can full screen the video and let's see what the LTX Studio actually came up with. So you can see that this shot is around three seconds. So we can click on plus here and add another shot. For example, Let's say I will add a, let's say just another prompt here. Let's say character sits on a rock powered moss, just like this. Shot type, I will go with the medium shot. And for the sound effects, I'll go with the same one, birds. Here, I will go with this one and I will click on generate a video. Now you can see that you cannot actually change the duration of the actual video so for the scene one it's only three seconds i believe for the rest of the scenes the rule will be the same basically three seconds now here you can also download it if you want to and duplicate it and if you for example click on edit frame here you can remove objects camera angle and also um, add some generative fill so here we have the next scene which is the second one if i preview this one as well you can see how it looks like however you can see that this model isn't perfect you can see for example the eyes the mouth everything isn't quite quite right keep in mind that this is only in beta so ltx studio is in beta so it's very early of the development here i'll also add another scene and let's say something else here hunting let's say character hunts a prey shot type i will go with the very wide one so for example white shot and for the sound effects let's say intense let's go with this one and let's click on generate a video and you can see here that we have already one scene second scene and now it's generating the third one and then we are going to see the actual preview of the whole movie so this is how you can basically create a very simple video using the ltx studio now here we also have this third scene so let me show you how it looks like so yeah it isn't as perfect as i would like so here i'll click on regenerate video and let's see the fixed video so it looks like this at the moment now it isn't perfect but i think that the altex studio won't generate anything better so here i will go with the preview and let's see the end result here So this is basically the end result here. You can also click on export right here and you can click uh, download it as 
editing package. You can also go to the presentation format of your storyboard, for example, and you can also download it as the MP4 video, which I think most of you guys will do. So yeah, this is pretty much it, how you guys can use LTX Studio beta i will also put a link for it in the video description below so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to just smash up the like button subscribe to the channel of course if you guys haven't already and have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you all in the next one peace